What's good, West Texas? Damian Bartonic here to talk about all things sports. And we have some important updates on tap, so let us get right into it. The Angelo State baseball team is in Cary, North Carolina, preparing for the second round of the College World Series after their 2-1 win against Southern New Hampshire on Sunday afternoon. Coach Brooks' squad may not be, in his eyes, the most talented group that he has had, but they are easily the most seasoned in terms of their preparation for big-time games. I mean, it, it is. It's, it, it is just another game. I mean, uh, you know, I think we approach hopefully every practice, every regular season game, just every game the same, which it, every practice, every game is a World Series game to us. And so uh, it can't get any bigger uh, than that. And, and that's how we try to approach every day. Now over to the Wall Hawks baseball team who'll be, who will be competing in the state championship after defeating the Brock Eagles last week. Head coach Jason Schneers reflects on what this moment means for his team. It's, it's every team's goal, and we're fortunate right now to be, I, th I think I looked at it the other day, over 600-something teams across the state, and there's 24 left. And so we're one of those those 24, and, you know, the, the end goal is so close. You can, you can taste it. two more wins. Moving to the gridiron, the Dallas Cowboys are grinding out OTAs, and defensive end Micah Parsons is taking this period of time to bulk up. Parsons was recently promoted to a full-time defensive end role this offseason, and in doing so, he's expected to put on 5 to 10 pounds of muscle in order to take the down-by-down -down punishment in the trenches. I want to be around 250, 252. Like, it's more of a muscle game, so that way I'm handling everything. So I wanted to lean out and just really put on good stuff and get into the best shape of my life for real. Now traveling to H-Town, the Houston Texans are in the middle of a quarterback battle between Davis Mills and second overall pick C.J. Stroud. Current third string quarterback Case Keenum has taken note of both players' skill sets and he believes that they both have been very impressive thoroughly up to this point. Uh, I will tell you Davis can absolutely sling it. He's an athlete. Uh, I have been very impressed uh, jumping in and seeing what he's able to do. Uh, the leadership that he has, the relatability to everybody on the team, I think he's, he's done so well. Um, CJ coming in here being, uh, I guess, I mean, he's been here, what, three weeks maybe? I mean, I would never know that. Now, this is just me, but if it is that close between signal callers, just roll with the rookie. But that will do it in sports. Keep it here for more news after the break. 